Regards, Dr. Byron Bucky Phillips, MBA. Click the link at the bottom, like the video, and subscribe to my channel. The title for this video is Finding Meaning in Work. Whether you're a contributor, non-contributor, leader, wannabe leader, or student, you can benefit from finding meaning in work and helping others find meaning in work. So what are the keys to finding meaning in work? How has meaning improved or declined as a result of more remote and hybrid work? Many people, unfortunately, live lives of quiet desperation, and they find no value or meaning at home or at work. But some people do rise to the challenge of finding work-life harmony. And remember, it's never work-life balance. You don't go to work and then have recreation and then have family. Those three things have to be meshed all the time. If you're not working 24 seven, you're not in the game. That's a reality in today's remote and hybrid work. Researchers have found fewer than 30% of people reported finding meaning in their lives. Christine Poroth, an expert in building community and embracing civility shared these facts. People with meaning in work were twice as happy as those who had no meaning. People with meaning at work were rated 25% better by their immediate supervisors. People with meaning at work were 47% more committed to their organization. People who were committed to work were 71% less burned out and burned up. People with meaning live lives seven years longer than those without meaning. Find meaning and create meaning. 